New iPhone 11 could miss out on an incredible Apple feature. New iPhone 11 is expected to debut in the coming months and bring a swathe of new improvements to the product line, however it seems the handset could miss out on an incredible Apple feature. New iPhone 11 is presumed to follow Apple tradition by being unwrapped in the month of September, meaning it may not be long before fans are shown the firm's latest and greatest handset. Rumors discussing the device surfaced as early as January this year when renowned tipster on leaks collaborated with Digit.in to showcase alleged renders of Apple's next flagship. The images showed the product with a new camera module on its rear housing three sensors. Since then, alleged models of Apple's next iPhone series have surfaced showcasing the firm's supposed 2019 offerings. One of the most prominent of which arrived courtesy of Mobile Fun. The outlet showed what it claimed were dummy units of the iPhone 11, iPhone 11 Max and iPhone 11 R. The claimed iPhone 11 and iPhone 11 Max were once again shown with a new square camera housing, seemingly corroborating on leaks prior claims. It has been speculated Apple's two new premium products will come with a primary, telephoto, and ultra-wide angle lens on their rear. Meanwhile, the Cupertino firm's iPhone XR successor has been tipped to come with a dual-camera system on its rear. Prominent Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo has previously suggested the cheaper device could come with a primary and telephoto sensor, possibly missing out on an ultra-wide-angle system. The front of each device has been rumored to be extremely similar to their respective predecessors, meaning the iPhone 11 and iPhone 11 Max may once again tout 5.8-inch and 6.5-inch displays respectively. Meanwhile, it is possible the iPhone 11 R could similarly flaunt a 6.1-inch LCD display. In addition to its rear camera, it has been speculated Apple's new iPhone series could include a new front-facing snapper and a turbocharged processor in the form of the presumably titled A13 Bionic. While the rumors for the tech powerhouse's 2019 iPhone series will surely give fans reason to be excited, it seems the next batch of handsets could miss out on a notable upgrade. Leaker Ice Universe recently took to Twitter and claimed Apple is considering introducing a display with a switchable 60Hz and 120Hz refresh rate for its 2020 iPhone. It was stated Apple is currently in talks with Samsung and LG to deliver such a feature. The tipster said, Apple is considering a switchable 60Hz 120Hz refresh rate screen on the iPhone in 2020, and is discussing with Samsung and LG. If Apple were to better the refresh rate of its iPhone, the smartphone series would catch up with the firm's iPad Pro tablet that was granted such a feature back in 2017. Essentially, the higher a display's refresh rate, the smoother navigating a device's user interface will be. When Express.co.uk reviewed the iPad Pro back in 2017, we were extremely positive about the 120Hz refresh rate on offer. Technology editor David Snelling said, the new iPad Pro also includes something called Promotion which helps it deliver refresh rates up to 120Hz. This makes scrolling through web pages and playing the latest apps feel far more fluid than ever before. Another benefit of promotion technology is that movies and videos look far better because the refresh rate of the display adjusts to match the frame rate of the content. Until you've used this new display you really can't appreciate just how good it is and Apple has just made every other tablet feel massively inferior. It is worth noting a few other flagship smartphones such as the OnePlus 7 Pro, Asus ROG Phone 2 and the Razer Phone 2 have ditched a typical mobile display refresh rate of 60Hz in favor of a smoother experience.